if it was a defense. How much pride did you feel coming off the field the other day, knowing how you guys had played? Um, man, I just feel great, man. Just going to go, go against a really great Texas team. Um, and we were waiting on this one, but um, it's by far not our best, um, best comp, I mean, not best competition, but um, best way of playing. Still got some room to go. Um, it's all full potential, but I um, feel very good, man. Just to um, live up to that hype on a really good Texas team and just play to our ability and, um, and do what we wanted to do um, on all phases of, of the ball and, and on defense. But um, again, a great Texas team, and we just want to um, prove to ourselves with OU who really are, but still a lot more room to prove it. Did you know, did you know that all along, even during the downtimes, that you guys were capable of that kind of defense? Um, definitely, man. I, I seen it. Um, as soon as I came in spring, not came in, but um, as soon as the spring and then went through um, through um, fall and through the summer, and it just played out really good how the defense was moving and how everyone was on board and everybody was capable of um, putting everything on the table and just leave it all on the table, man. Um, just um, trying to um, execute the fundamental forward and get to the bottom line. That's just what we've been focusing on, man. We worry about us first and let the media handle the rest of the things. But most important, we worry about us um, to get this great def um, defensive mindset. Was there a moment that, since it's your it was your final um, Red River game, that really stood out to you that let you know that, hey, this was special and that you'll probably take with you as you go on with the rest of your career? Um, definitely, man. I just got to play um, – be, in, be, be able to be a part of these for all four of the Red River Rivalry games, man. Historical moment. And, and it really satisfied me now, but it's going to play a big part in, in a good five years and 10 years or so. Like, man, I really played in this game. And just to, they still doing these type of games when I'm long gone after before. But I um, just wanted to appreciate the Red River Rivalry game. It was a tough um, Texas team. And we fought, man. We fought day in and day out. And just to be a part of it and leave it all on the field, play to my, one of my um, capable games and best of my ability. And my last last River River rivalry game, this was outstanding. I just um, I just love what we did, and I'm ready to move forward. As a senior, you're a guy who's been part of some really good defensive performances, notably the game in Columbus a couple of years ago. But where does last week's game rank, and just among the best team defensive performances that you've seen in your four years here? Um, man, I gotta say that's one of the top two, top three, definitely, man. And just to get on. Um, a record-setting team, nine sacks, man. That mm -hmm. was outstanding. But there's a lot more opportunities we had out there, man. We still got to improve them. But I would say that was one of um, about the top two, top three defensive game that we had. But mm -hmm. um, by far, not our best game, man. Mm -hmm. We want to keep pushing. Do you sense a higher level of confidence after the game than maybe before? Definitely, man. It's definitely something you can feed on, especially on a great Texas team. Um, they didn't score um, offensive touchdowns. Um, throwing the ball, so man, they just gotta do better. We got still gotta get better in the run game, but and we gotta feed off this type of momentum, man. Just keep feeding on throughout the season. We don't want to stop here, we want to keep getting better and better. And something like this can't satisfy us, we gotta keep going. Part of turnovers were such an emphasis over the offseason. Well, this defense has been a lot better, those, those numbers haven't uh, taken a dramatic turn, obviously, especially the last couple of weeks. How much of a concern is that? And what what do y'all need to do better to force more of those? Oh, man, um, it's a major concern, especially in the emphasis we do. We probably do um, about the most team that work on these type of emphasis day in and day out. And sometimes just upsetting when we don't get these turnovers that we put huge emphasis on. But, man, we never give up, though. We got to keep fighting. We're going to get them balls out. Like I say, it might not be today. It might not be next week. They're going to come in a, in a great time when we need it most. So, man, at the end of the day, we got all, all 11 hands to the ball. We keep everybody keep scraping to the ball, keep forcing the ball out, keep punching. And some someday, somehow, something's going to happen. Is there something you can pinpoint that y'all haven't done? To, to force many of those? Um, I just think we haven't get more active hands to the ball. I think we just focus on getting the ball carried down, more bodies on the ball carried, and more focus on emphasis where one hitting and one stripping it out. Um, man, we just got to keep practicing, keep working on it, though, man. Um, and today is hard trying to get the ball out, man. Um, I know teams fo focus on huge um, emphasis on protecting the ball just as much as we do. So we got to keep fighting, man. got to keep going. So uh, I just love the way we, the direction we're going, and we, we keep moving forward. Appreciate it. What do you like the way around the defensive line has played, especially this past game? Man, defensive line, man. Um, we got a high praise to the defensive line. I love those guys, man. Stars there, man. Um, the, great, the better job they do, the less job the defense end, the back end you have to do. Um, it's just that simple. D line do their job and back end do their job. We all play a good um, complimentary defense. But um, I just want to keep pushing, keep feeding off this motivation, man. This is not the end, and it's about far not our best game. We're going to keep pushing. When you talk about not being